Hello all. It is I, the Beast, and it is my sad duty to inform you that I do not have a product for the day because I've been looking for something very particular. Something uh, with a bit of a peanut buttery flavour. Something with a little bit of a crunch and a little bit more salt than you'd normally get with a peanut butter product. And maybe just a hint of chocolate. But uh, you see, I I'm not able to find anything of that variety. So, I mean, if you're out there, if you can think of anything at all, just anything, and that would be absolutely fantastic. Anyone, I implore all of you. Wait, what's, what? Oh, thank you. That's a fast work right there, isn't it? Well, uh, whoever did this, I appreciate it. Thank you for supplying me with this Reese's Big Cup. And oh, it ticks all of the boxes. Not only is it big, not only does it have peanut butter, not only does it have chocolate, but it also has pretzels. So on the plus side here, there's not going to be too much of a mystery what's in here. It says basically Reese's Big Cup with pretzels. So I'm glad they're not really trying to, you know, strain their brains with a creative name for this sort of thing. But, um, well, that rhymed a bit, didn't it? The rain in Spain falls mainly in the plains. Anyway, uh, that's neither here nor there, but it looks like we actually have an, uh, an installment of Beastly Reviews today, thanks to whomever threw this through the uh, computer screen. I greatly appreciate it. We all know what a Reese's Peanut Butter Cup looks like, so this isn't going to be that much of a mystery. Might as well open it and see exactly what we've got, what we're working with. Oh, this looks nothing like a peanut butter cup. Yeah, I don't know what this actually is. Just kidding, it looks exactly like a peanut butter cup. And a big one at that, as I mentioned on the tin. So, uh, yeah, not really much of a mystery here, but how does it taste, eh? That's why you're here. You're here to find out. Hmm. I see no pretzel, but I'm sure it's in there somewhere. It's blending lovely, so, you know, bottoms up. Hmm. Okay, so if you saw this weekend's, um, if you checked your Instagram over the weekend and noticed my mini beastly review, uh, you'll notice that um, Rhesus doesn't always knock it right out of the park like it usually does. And uh, this is another one of those cases where I don't think they really knocked it out of the park, so to speak, because um, I, taste, I taste nothing of pretzel in this. This basically just tastes like um, like a very large uh, Reese's peanut butter cup with uh, with you know with a bit of crunch. So uh, if anyone recalls, I believe it was in the early to mid '90s, Reese's uh, had re and they might have released them perpetually throughout the years, but Reese's used to have a peanut butter cup with uh, peanuts in it. This is a bit reminiscent of that, only larger. Um, so. To me, it basically just tastes like a very large peanut butter cup with a bit more crunch. Uh, not much. I do not taste a pretzel at all. I mean, uh, I guess, what the hell, uh, 180 calories for the whole thing. Maybe I just got the wrong hat. Bottoms up, let's try it. What I do for the name of art. <sighs> hmm. Hmm. Crunch. Hmm. Hmm. You see, I'm not saying it's bad. It's not bad at all, actually. It's actually quite good. But I do love Reese's peanut butter cups. I really just, I don't taste any pretzel. I taste no pretzel, none whatsoever. It's um, a bit more reminiscent of the peanut butter Twix bar, which is all my, my all time favorite candy until they ruined it. It was all fantastic back in the 80s and early 90s. Of course, everything was better back then, though. It's a bit reminiscent of that. Well, the Reese's Peanut Butter Cups with the peanuts, uh, you know, in them, as I mentioned before. But as far as pretzel, I taste zero pretzel whatsoever. So basically, it's just like a extra large Reese's Peanut Butter Cup, in my opinion. Um, so I can't really give this a stellar score. Reese's Peanut Butter Cups are fantastic. We all know that. This is just basically a large one, so I'd probably give this a 7 out of 10 uh, for execution. Or, or for, for um, you know, for flavor. For, as far as execution is concerned with the pretzel... 
Uh, this would probably be like a 4 out of 10 at best, because I got the crunch, but I got absolutely no flavor whatsoever. But if you got the flavor of this video and you enjoyed it, please be sure to check it out on YouTube IGTV. And follow me on Beasted Reviews Instagram. And feel free to go over to Twitter too and add me too. Just, I don't really go on Twitter, but whatever. Uh, I, I like followers and, you know, I feel very, very underconfident. I have some very... I, I have some deep-seated issues with the size of my Twitter following. And as a man, you can probably understand how that is. So please, help a brother out! Anyway, until next time, cheers!